Hi, this is Marty with another Photoshop quick tip. I'm going to show you how to wrap text around shapes no matter how irregular they are. Open an image that you'd like to wrap text around. It could be a shape or a photo of something or someone. I downloaded this one from Shutterstock. The first step is to make a selection around the shape. There are many ways to do this and the method you choose should depend on the characteristics of your image. For this image, I'll use the Quick Selection tool. If you're using this tool as well, drag it inside your subject to select it. Once you make a selection around your subject, you can check it by pressing Q to see it as a quick mask. Then revert it back into a selection by pressing Q again. Go to Select, Modify, and Expand. The amount you expand it will determine how close or how far away your text will be from the edge of your subject. Invert the selection by pressing Ctrl or Command Shift I. Open the rectangular marquee tool and click the Intersect With icon. Place your tool where you'd like to begin your text and drag it to the opposite corner to the point where you'd like your text to end. It essentially creates a frame that your text will be confined inside of. When you release your mouse or pen, it removes your subject selection that was outside the rectangle. Open your Paths panel. If you don't see it, go to Window and Paths. Click the icon at the upper right and click Make Work Path. Keep its default tolerance of 0.5 pixels. Open back your Layers panel and open your Horizontal Type tool. Click the Character Paragraph Panels icon or go to Window and Character. Click inside the work path. Lorem Ipsum text will automatically appear inside the work path if you're using Photoshop version CC 2014 or later. Lorem Ipsum is essentially filler text. It's meant to serve what your actual text will ultimately look like. I'll delete it for now by pressing the Delete key. There are three ways to add text inside a work path. One way is to actually type your text. The second way is to open the text from an outside source and highlight it. Press Ctrl or Command C to copy it and Ctrl or Command V to paste it into the work path. If you're using version CS6 or later, the third way is to go to Type and paste Lorem Ipsum. This fills your entire work path with the text. To adjust your text's size and spacing, Double-click the large T of your text layer to highlight all of your text and go to the character panel that we opened earlier. Dragging the size icon to the left or right decreases or increases your text size. Dragging the letting icon to the left or right decreases or increases the amount of space between your lines of text. Open the paragraph panel. Presently, my text is justified to the right because that icon is active. You can see that my text is hugging the right edge of my work path. When I click this icon, it justifies my text on the left side of my work path. If I want my text to hug both sides, I'll click this icon. I'll click back on this icon to justify it on the left side. Open your Paths panel and make the top work path active. Click inside the right work path and click the icon that will justify your text respectively. I'll paste in Lorem Ipsum again. I'll open my Move tool and close the Character Paragraph panels. This has been a Photoshop Quick Tip from Marty at Blue Lightning TV. Thanks for watching.